Walt Disney Company CEO Bob Iger during the 2023 annual shareholder meeting and quite a few interesting things to say. We covered it live here on Valiant Renegade on April 3rd. What you're about to hear are some clips from that show. And in this case, in a stunning moment, CEO Bob Iger seemed to compare the LGBTQIA plus movement and specifically the quote unquote family friendly drag shows that they have been supporting to the civil rights movement of the 1960s and the heroism of the greatest generation during World War II. It's bizarre. We'll let you be the judge. Here we go. When he equates the LGBTQ representation with the civil rights movement. And, and World oh, War that was, II. That, that was, was and so World cringe. War. I it cannot was so believe we, I mean, that he, again, he, he makes that mistake of putting those together. It he is political suicide MLK to do that. And Rosa Parks to... My, my comment is, is it wise for the company to take political positions that sat oh. to satisfy a very small Circle portion back. of the people when our primary mission is entertainment. Ah! He, circled, he circled back and threw him off. Okay, well, Raymond, first of all, I, I respect uh, your position on this and appreciate no, you don't. your question. Um, and I, I would like to address that. I, look, first of all, as the CEO of the company, I think my job is to strive to do what I think is best for our business. And that includes doing best what's best for our cast members or our employees. And, and what will enable both to flourish. Uh, I don't think we Your duty should is or to can the customer and the shareholders, issue. not the employees. And I also understand you share there are going to be gray areas. There are going to be times when we decide to weigh in on an issue that we believe is worthy of debate because of its relevance and importance to our business or to our employees. And there are, there are times when I actually believe we shouldn't. But I strongly feel that we alone have to determine whether, when, or or how to weigh in on, a, on an issue, whether it's private or public, of course, with the standard that when we take a position on those matters, there's a true reason why we have. And in almost all Should cases, always it be has to be, be because it, uh, it directly affects uh, our business or our people. This is and why Vanguard back, left you know, the DEI decades, corporate climate change stuff. Corporate Americans express themselves on numerous issues of both right and wrong. And our country, I think, is better off for that. And this was evident during the civil rights era, as I recall, as a child, when a lot of companies weighed in on no injustices that they saw in America. About bedroom issues it was with certainly the civil true era. during World War II. He just did. Stood in silence. He's comparing oh teaching four-year-olds bedroom uh, issues still, with World War II. Um, you know, carry the stain of indifference. So as long as I'm in the job, I'm going to continue to be guided by a sense of the stain of indifference and, and for four-year-olds getting education on do drag in, queens. We in because. The issue he's is gone off the rails. He's off he the rails. The work for us. He has. Thank you. Holy crap on a stick. He's lost his mind. Today comes from Chris. We do have somebody here who I'm sure has several thoughts to share that has not been able to chime in yet. We're going to bring her in right now. Please help me welcome the very lovely Disney blogger, Miss Lorena Creole. I'm so glad she's here. Hello, hello, you guys. How are you doing? Hello. Hey, Lorena. Hey. Glad you're here. Say hi to the audience. Sixteen hundred of you here, please. If hey, you're not sub everybody. to Lorena Creole, make sure you so head out there and sub to Lorena. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. Lorena, were you able to catch uh, all of this? I oh lord, not <laughs> everything, but apparently I came in on the part that uh, I was intended to uh to drop in on so i got there right on my favorite part when they start asking us uh the q a civilian so civilian uh shareholders you have one two three not a whole lot of shares but this is the one time a year where we can actually put the ceo on the hot seat and i didn't think we would ever get a question that would top when uh uh, Chapek got asked if Kathleen Kennedy was going to get fired, but apparently we have up the uh, ante. <laughs> Yo, God, yeah. After up 10. Indeed. Woo! And just so everybody knows, 
What's great about Lorena here is she is also a Disney stockholder. As yes. apart from being you're just a Disney blogger and vlogger, you're also a Disney stockholder. So tell us your thoughts on what you did get to hear. Well, uh, what I did hear was a lot of disdain on the part of Iger when it comes to the state of Florida and Floridians, especially when it comes to Disney. Iger basically gives this idea of that Disney is everything in Florida, and that is not the case. That is definitely not yeah. a, not a, not the case whatsoever. They are a large employer, but they are not the largest employer in the state of Florida. That honor would go to Publix, which is Florida yes. owned. And a lot Where of shopping people don't is a realize pleasure. that, especially when they drop that fried chicken when it comes to mm. the air. Oh God, it's just, it's just delicious. But I'm listening to it, and the part where um, one of the callers, uh, one of the shareholders called in and talked about the activist entertainment path that Disney is on, and you heard the pleadings of, can you guys please get back to the classic Disney that was for everyone and that we enjoyed and not go with this Skittles Nation activist dialogue the way that you guys are going? And when Iger answered that question, talking about how, you know, it's their basic duty to stand up for what's right, he makes the mistake that is not going to go over well with a lot of people and not going to go over well with a lot of black people like myself, mm -hmm. just talking about myself, when he equates the LGBTQ representation with the civil rights movement. And, and oh, World that, War was, II. That, that was and so World cringe. War II. He just sunk a whole lot of interest that some black people may have had that in was seeing this so uh, little Remy reboot, but that clip, that clip, that, and circulated around. I it cannot so not believe we, I mean, that he, again, he, he makes that mistake of putting those together. It he is political suicide MLK to do that. And Rosa Parks to drag queens doing <sighs> porn dances for kids. It, it is absolutely ridiculous. What and happened? Is, he he knows his politics better than this. I mean, even John Kerry, John Kerry did this when he was running for president. He literally had to hold his hands up to ask the crowd to stop booing so that he could take back his statement. <laughs> you I mean, don't where's you don't make this comparison. Where's the clip of Jeb Bush? Please clap. <laughs> yes, I, I mean, please. What? Somebody needs to meme that and put Iger's face on it. Oh God, <laughs> that it's is so quite bad. The f it and it's and it's what's not being, I guess, highlighted a lot is how many black parents have been in opposition, have been for this bill in Florida. We don't need that kind of indoctrination to our kids. We are wholeheartedly against that, but you don't see those videos and you don't hear from those parents. You don't see that. Disney doesn't want to acknowledge that at all, but equating LGBTQ with the civil rights movement Videos and clips that you see of black people basically having dogs and fire hoses turned on them in a period of time where my grandparents grew up and they told me the blatant racial discrimination that they got. When my grandfather said, you know, it's a day that ends in Y that I wasn't called the N word, you know, yeah. to equate that experience that black people had in this country to sexual preference you have got to be freaking kidding me literally i i haven't activated it but i literally put my stocks i have not hit the sell button but i was so freaking close so close put the order up have not hit the button yet because i kind of told myself I don't and we are, we are we are we are not market. advocating we are not advocating buys or sells on any no we stocks. are not this is this, I know, I know, yeah <laughs> That's but just Lorena. Make that I, I wasn't trying to jump you on that one, but I know. Nah, you guys know, know the. Uh, I, I gotta say, it, I gotta only, say it on YouTube. You gotta say it. I know. Gotta put that disclaimer out there. Yes. That you guys is know the only just, good no. thing that went well for Iger in this one. All of Anybody the pre-recorded stuff. <laughs> Pro, go go he, ahead. I'm sorry. The one the one good thing for Iger, there were no follow up questions allowed. 
You can thank his lucky <laughs> yeah. stars for that one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>